again up here in this Delhi Science Lab. In this lab, we can have multiple classes working together in a variety of different activities and demos, using real tools for science and getting some hands-on experience. The great thing about working in the lab is that multiple classes can be here together and give younger students a chance to see what some of the older students are working on and give them a bit of a preview of what they might want to choose in their upcoming grades. In grade 9 and 10, students will take a general science course that covers topics in biology, chemistry, earth science, physics, and even astronomy. And grade 11 and 12, students will have a chance to choose between those topics uh, for specializing in one of the courses, depending on what their options are for post-secondary. Many students choose more than one uh, science course for their post-secondary program. Hi there, I'm just here to talk for a brief few moments about Marine Biology 11. It's a class that typically mostly grade 10s take that are super interested in science and in the marine world. Um, a lot of the stuff we do in class is based on project-based work and a little bit more hands-on stuff, but we also cover all as about 80% of the Bio 11 curriculum requirements as well. Uh, the typical student that takes Marine Biology 11 is fairly academic or really, really likes fish and marine life and uh, I encourage you to check it out. Biology is pretty fun. A lot of it's memorization, but it's all interesting. Um, and you get to do a lot of dissections once you're in uh, grade 11. Um, and it's interesting. You get to learn about uh, how interconnected a lot of things are and um, just the way things work, which is surprisingly nice to know. Um, and any advice that I would give is just that if you don't feel like you're understanding something or you feel like the stuff is moving a bit too fast for you, especially during all this COVID stuff, it's been hectic for everybody, um, just ask your teacher. Like, they're there to help you and a lot of people might think that they just don't get stuff in school and they're just dumb. Like, you're not. Everyone can get this. It just takes a little bit of, like, trying and you can get there. The lab here at Stelly's is great. Um, the large space with all of the equipment lets you really get a huge experience. The lab gives you a huge exposure to everything to do with physics, biology, and especially chemistry with a whole half of the lab dedicated to that. Hey, uh, we're excited to welcome you to the Stelly's Math Department. I'm Mr. Gillespie. And uh, yeah, we have lots of good things going on in this department. We have uh, courses for all students. We have uh, some courses like numeracy courses for some students who may have struggled in their, uh, in their elementary and middle school years to sort of catch up and get, uh, get some of those basic skills covered. We have workplace courses and uh, trades courses for students who plan on going on into, uh, into the trades. And we have the academic courses like pre-calculus and calculus for those that wanna go on to, uh, to university and maybe do a science or engineering program at university. We also have morning and after school math help for students. So uh, if you are in a course and you find that you're struggling a little bit, um, we can offer some names of, of tutors outside the school, but we also offer free in-school tutoring before and after school. Most aspects of math have been challenging for me. Here at Stelly's, there are lots of supports to help students with math. Both before and after school homework help made it possible for me to be successful. The math teachers here are helpful and flexible to allow me to reach my post-secondary goals. The other thing we have uh, that we offer is math contests. So for students who are really keen and want to uh, sort of show off their skills, we've had students uh, at Stelly's that have gone on to provincial and even national recognition for math contests. So, we're looking forward to seeing you here and uh, we'll see you soon.